want to hunt for some turtles in here somewhere a four to settle down a four turtles and we're setting them free today why are we setting them free Toon? because we're gonna grow a snail in here that's right we've got this uh, tank earmarked as our water snail tank well one of many and what's the turtle's favorite food Toon? snail <laughs> That's right. They would Anywhere, <laughs> I don't know, but our turtle likes snails. Yeah, they decimate the apple snail operation that we're, we're currently expanding on. So they've got to come out of here uh, and then we'll fully convert this into the part of our snail venture. She's got one. So there's four in here. Toon recently caught another one in the river Two earlier this ago. week. Yeah, when she was cutting some additional grass for the goats. There's one. That landing's net is not going to be big enough for Tommy, is it? Tommy Turtoy. Tommy Turtoy. <laughs> he's a big unit, he is. Well, I'm not sure if he's a boy or girl. We haven't checked underneath to see if he's got a uh, flat stomach or a concave stomach. Apparently the concave stomach ones are the boys, so they don't fall off the girls. You can find where they are, but... They're normally hiding in the corners, isn't it? You'll see there's a lot of algae in here. We topped this up yesterday. Uh, we were pumping water out of one of the fish ponds. Uh, and then the heavens opened. We got a proper downpour of rain yesterday. So it's extra full now. And this this bit here with the sand on is normally sitting sitting proud of the water line. Where are they hiding? Oh. See the head. Got me a turtle. Not this one, isn't it? One I picked. <laughs> Two days ago. This is the one you found with the gang, isn't it? Yeah, caught that with ow, our dog. Ow, Jeff and wife, Deb. Ow! Careful your fingers, missus. This boy or girl? Girl. Whatever. I think we've got four girls. We were given two turtles, one by Toon's nephew. And one by the guy who works here for us sometimes. Uh, but what we didn't realise is one of them was infested with leeches. And when we put them in here, we then realised. So we had to get them back out and we, we put them in a strong salt water wash in that tank there. And just kept on changing it every day. And uh, they're nice and, nice and clear of the leeches now. But it took, took a couple of weeks. Yay! We've got Tommy. Need bigger to live it up. <laughs> <laughs> Tommy Turtoy. So we're going to pop these in the lake and put them in near the. We're going to put them in the side where there's still some long grass remaining around the outside of the lake. And if they come over that, that's another girl, yeah. Ooh. I believe. What's that, my love? Give us the, the super bun down now they come out. Well, it's not changed into a girl, is it? A nice size. Mm. But this is the only one we got with the yellow head, isn't it? Yep. Try it out. Mm. Try. <laughs> so, just your tiny one no, to find. In, then. That's alright, they'll just. Yeah, but I was scaring up my finger, didn't I? No. Yeah, take this one out. Why are you? Mm. It's alright, my turtle whisperer. Right. Right, you nib one to find. You nib turtle. What we normally do with this water is use some of the the zooplankton for feeding our baby crayfish and also we feed our fruit trees with this really good stuff it looks howling but there's no there's no mozzies in here because we put a few guppies in here and they keep keep on top of it there's a sh few shrimp in here as well same as in that tank there's loads of shrimp and crabs in there even the little uh, glass shrimp they're very good at catching the the mosquito larvae you got her? Mm -hmm. Nib 
มากเลยอินสเปย์บีเฮ้ยก็น่าอิดไหม Hold it a bit higher up in the face or use that for this Whoa! Scan it. Never underestimate the power of a small turtle's <laughs> matches. <laughs> Here, yeah. <laughs> and that's why we don't go skinny dipping, do we? Mm. Toon's got what we call a manga chon, and uh, the bullfrogs love them. So let's let's see. <laughs> but John loved them as well, not but John, yeah. Standing hook. Yeah, good fishing bait. Look, ah. look, they stay on a rock. Who gonna get this? Whoa! Did you get it or not? No, it's still there. Got a big spider next to him. f i n a l l y Safe for now. Lucky. Panking, panking frog. Hmm. <laughs> Scarier than our cannibalistic catfish, these bullfrogs. Video on them coming up soon. Well, here we are underneath. A female tree, Twiggy, a neem tree. We're going to let them go over here. The reason being, there's a little bit of vegetation on the shelf here. But if they do migrate, which turtles do quite often, if they go over here, down the other side, then we've got our old quicksand pond there and our irrigation canal. So we've got the best chance possible of keeping them on our land. If they leave our land, then chemicals can get them, burning can get them, and also people. Eat People do eat them as well. Okay, you're gonna put them away together. Let them go together. Yeah. Can't hold them up. Well, I'm cameraman, m i s s e s aren't I? Just scared, eh? Turtle racing. Off you go, geezer. And away. This one, not so much. Get some full-on racing action, and we're off. Come on, lightning! Go nibbler! Go nibbler! Go nibbler! Whoa! Face plant. b y l e o o h big wow! Come on! Oh dear! You know why she, he didn't want to go, or she didn't want to go? Whoa! <laughs> I had like a cannonball rolling down there. Yeah. I'm definitely not skinny dipping in here now. No, no, no! Ah! Oh. 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 Ne, n i b l e No, h n e No. Whoa! And another one in the middle. Na, come into you. <laughs> Excellent. Oh. Well, let's hope they stay around. It's lovely to see. Well, let's hope they're happy. Stay here, you guy. Yeah, stay here, stay safe. Well, that's our one and only turtle video. Unless they stay and they have baby turtles. Yeah. There's the old ball and chain over there. Yeti and Lucy. All right, whatever, mate. A lot of the time we've been feeding them. Uh, dog biscuit, and uh, but the, they'll have um, like catfish pellets. They eat vegetation as well, but they'll take dead fish, live fish if they can catch them. Uh, but snails are by far and away their favourite. We didn't realise at the start, and there were some snails in there. We just use them to keep on top of the algae, and uh, within about a week, they'd all gone. Put some more in there. Next day, they were gone. So, yeah, they've. They got a sweet tooth for the old snails, so snail farming and keeping turtles doesn't really work out too well.
There are snails in the in the lake, obviously, but four turtles in a giant lake be fine. Right, back to the house, missus. Back to the house. You got what? washing to do and woman stuff like that. No, I do a snail. Oh, I love your snails more than your husband now. I love my snail. <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, I want to see this one. <laughs> Show the camera because that was really cool. That. Honey, you see, you see where they had in here before. Mm -hmm. Look how big they are. Look how fast they're growing. <laughs>